What's up, everybody? It is Mr. Jenkins here from MGMClassicCars.com, Addison, Illinois. And today I'm bringing you this new arrival, 1967 Chevrolet Camaro. I'm going to give you my thoughts and opinions on this car. Now, this car is a joy to drive. Under the hood, we have a 383 stroker paired with a Tremec 5-speed manual transmission. Super, super fun combo. The thing sounds great. You got, I believe, Global West control arms, QA1 shocks. It's got the works, aluminum radiator, aluminum cylinder heads, nice crate engine, Mallory ignition system. The paint is a really, really nice, almost like a candy apple red. Gorgeous paint job. The car sounds really, really nice. It runs really nice. Let's get in here so I can rev it up so you can hear this baby. Let's take a listen to that. It's got, it's running at a cool, about 165 degrees. The oil pressure is pretty good. Volts. There's a Tremec five-speed manual transmission, retro sound radio. They did about $5,000 worth of uh, sound system work in this car. There's an amp in the back. You got speakers. This thing sounds great, this stereo system in this car. It's got a sub, I believe. You got your Grant GT steering wheel. Horn does not work. Let's put on the flashers and the lights and test them. Let's turn the fan off. I believe we have a... Now the light doors are probably vacuum operated, so let's turn the car on. not open I'm not sure actually looking at it I believe they are manual you have to open them manually so somebody installed that at least that's what it looks like to me if that's not the case they are probably vacuum operated you can speak with your sales representative for that one, we have a full service center and uh, they could dive deeper into that for you. The lights do work. The, the blinkers work, flashers. I am missing one S on there, on the fender. Now all of our cars are sold as is, if you would like any of the flaws to be addressed or taken care of, please talk to your sales representative and they will set you up with a quote from the sales department or the service department. Let's turn this thing off, turn the flashers off. And man, it just runs and drives great. The lights work. Let's try the wipers. Wipers work. the blower motor come on blower motor comes on you can feel it so the heat works pretty much everything folks it's got the gorgeous stance to it i love the stance american racing torque thrust wheels with bf goodrich radial da's just a nice nice combo like i said i'm not sure what the story is on the headlights here I do want to say maybe they are um, analog, like you have to do them yourself. That's what it kind of looks like to me. But other than that, there you go. 
Let's close this hood. Oh, you got a Wilwood master cylinder. And there's your trim tag. I know you guys like to see those. Hooker headers, they look like they're an inch and three quarter primary. I'm not sure. Hood closes nicely and the body lines up great. SS hood. Overall, really, really nicely done car. Whoever did it, did a great job. I have underneath photos on the website and everything you'd ever need. If you are interested in this car, please contact us at 847-848-1850. This car is located at our warehouse in Addison, Illinois. Look at those slotted and drilled front disc brakes as well. We offer special financing for all of our classic cars with great monthly payments and shipping all over the United States, open and closed, bonded and insured. We have special financing for our classic cars with great monthly payments. And we have a full service department. So if any of the issues, once again, you want them addressed, please talk to your sales representative and they will get a quote from the sale, uh, service department and they will get you helped out. Our business hours are 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Monday through Friday, Saturday, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. all by appointment only. My name is Mr. Jenkins, and it's been a pleasure showing you this 1967 Chevy Camaro, and I hope everyone has a great day. Hope to see you here soon. Bye, everyone. Let's get the, home, the car you've always wanted home in your garage, because remember, it sure looks good here, but it'll look a whole lot better in your garage.